I'm Marlene Williams from St. Francis Care Foundation. We've started this thing 12 years ago by doing feeding schemes, looking after the AIDS, the abandoned and the abused. We've started it at my place, just a few kilometers from here. We are at the place at St. Francis. We got our own plot where we are staying and then we've started there. And then I had a vision to do this, to look after children. And I've started this six years ago. And um, I start, first started with 10 children. And then after that, the amount grew up to 52. And then today I got 52 kids. I have to support them on a grant of 1,200 rand. And then my husband is my great source of help because many a times he'll go out and then do a job for us so that we can live. And then also we are dealing with children that is very traumatized. Like for instance, they need to have medication, those that are raped and the ones that are full blown HIV for medication. And then I get up four o'clock in the morning to start with the first lot taking them out. My husband is taking them out to school. And then if there's uh, those of them that is supposed to go for hospital, my husband come and take them. And then I prepare the pup for the first one that goes six o'clock. And then after that, the other lot goes at seven o'clock and the last lot goes at five past seven. So I have to prepare for each and every one of them, but then with doing things all by myself. Uh, the, the age range for the children is from six months up to 21. Uh, why 21, 21 years is that they grew up with me and then there's no way that I can put them out now unless they are, unless we get jobs for them. That is where I set them free to go out and be on their own. And then we, we are working on a salary of 1,200 and then we get help from people outside that gives us food. Now we have Meals on Wheels and then we got Gresham, uh, Nature's Choice and there's a lot of people that open their hearts unto us. But they do their best to help us but we are still in need of so much things. As you can see that we are staying in a place like this that is vandalized and we, it's just to keep the children like safe for them to stay in a safe place. And um, I please, please, can you all help us, anybody that can hear this message? Our kids and us, we need help. Help us, please. In anything that you can do for us, please help us. I'm Selwyn Williams, and uh, I just want to add what my wife says. Mm. Yes, this is our passion to do this with the children. All these years, it was my passion. I was working, and then I, we started to to, to, to feed families. We even pray to God, they must show us which people, four people we can help. So we start buying groceries for them. And then one day my, my wife found a kid in the street and there they decided to open this place, like a, a home for children. And uh, so we, we registered at the St. Francis Care Foundation and uh, I, we love what we do for these children when they have nowhere to go. We and there's everything to Yes, and, and we lost everything. I put all my money into this, into and this, and this, and this ministry, when it's not a business, this is a ministry. It's here to make a difference in, in people's life. Mm. Like every morning, like now, I come from the clinic, take the children to the clinic to get the medicines and uh, the milk for the, for the children, the one who is HIV positive. And every morning I woke up at four o'clock in the morning mm. to take the children to different schools. And then I came back, then we could carry on with a, with a daily, daily basis. But I'm thankful to God that I can make a difference in somebody else's life. But we need help to do it. We can't do it by our own. We, we thought we can do it by our own, but we need help to to sustain this ministry. Please help us. Thank you, we love you.